Hi, and welcome to At The Movies with Adam Ross. On today's episode, I'll be reviewing Rush. And I actually like Rush, which is surprising for me because I hate cars. I'm not into them in any way. That part of masculinity escaped me. I'm not into it. I don't like the Formula One. I probably like the girls that go to that, the cocaine and the champagne, but the racing itself, I can leave it. And that's what a good film does, is it makes you interested in something that you never were interested in before. And this is directed by Ron Howard, but you couldn't tell because this is a film that seems like it's made by a much younger filmmaker. He has stolen Danny Boyle's famous cinematographer, Anthony Dodd Mantle. The guy has shot things like Slumdog Millionaire, Dread 3D, and he's made movies that really pop, that are just you know amazing to look at. And so the combination of these two, Howard doing some interesting things behind the camera, and Dodd Mantle's amazing cinematography makes this for a really vivid cinematic experience. Now, this film is better than it has any right to be, mainly because of Peter Morgan's script. So what is the toffee dude that wrote The Queen doing making a movie about Formula One? Now, it's because he's interested in the characters. He's interested in Daniel Brühl, who plays Nicky Lauder, and then you've got Chris Hemsworth, who plays James Hunt. And there's this fierce rivalry between the two. And Morgan cuts right to that. And so he's got this kind of duplicitous study of characters, and he shades it with grey. And so there's no good guy, there's no bad guy. And it makes this film a little bit shaggy in some places. And I'm like, you know, what is kind of the point of this, of having an even keel? Because traditional movies, you want someone to root for, and you're not sure how you should feel in some of the sequences. But eventually, this movie, it gets its hooks into you, and then by the end, in traditional Ron Howard form, you're really invested in this movie, and you're really going for it. Um, Howard is a journeyman director, and has done a little bit of everything, from Backdraft to How the Grinch Stole Christmas to Cinderella Man. He tries his hand at every genre, and he's a great filmmaker. And um, look, I absolutely adore Cinderella Man, the boxing film he made with Russell Crowe a couple of years ago. And this is um, up there with some of Howard's best work. So look, even if you're not into Formula One, I definitely um, suggest you go and check this one out because the acting is so good from Hemsworth and Brawl that um, it must be seen. And even if you're not into cars, you will be by the end of this film. So. I'd give this one four stars out of five.